Alright, what is up you guys, and of course as always, welcome back to another OU battle, which is truly the Sky Render, and today we're going up against AJ, and I've been, I wanted to build a team around Taurus and their Manitan, and while they don't necessarily synergize well together, I had an idea of how to maybe let them rip through teams, and we'll see how that goes, and here is one team for the ages, really good team from my opponent, we see absolutely a stick web team here. And Rage, you're really looking out of the park. Sometimes it's worth asking on Twitter, AJ, you're an absolute mad lad. Um, now that said, possible good leads from his side. Uh, I figure uh, it makes sense for him to lead off with something like Galvantula, right? Um, I'm gonna lead off with... No, I'm not. Um, this is actually quite rough. Naturally quite rough. I think there is no job player of me leading off with Thoros, even though he has stickweb shenanigans. Overall, I'm actually faster than anything on his team with Thoros, so Thoros, if done right, don't suffer all that much versus this. Barring Golok, which is a very fair lead. So really hope that is not happening here. Uh, <laughs> alright, alright, I'm excited. I'm actually really excited. Um, been a lot of Ubers lately, so finally having a proper game, it's it's exciting. Let's see, Hydreigons, that's a good lead. <sighs> this feels specs, however. Or Scarfed, I mean. Do I want to go really overdo this? I feel the U-turn is such an easy play for him. Uh, I don't want to risk it too much. I want to see what it does. I'm a sold this anyway, and if it decides to say, I can first impression through, which is always nice. We'll see what happens. Just decides to go for try attack. Oh, oh my God! Clutched it. All right. Still, though, first impression is to play. I do believe I force, I force him out here. Um, if he stays in, that's um. Dead Hydreigon. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's why we use Kulisa Pod. I love this guy. It's not underrated Pokemon either. It's just overall phenomenal. I guess if I would go and give it some type of... Um, if I wish it was going to be a bit better, I would say Body Press would have been nicer of close combat. 140 base defense is really... It's outrageously high. <laughs> right, here comes Galvantula. And here's the thing with Galvantula, there is... There is no switch in for me. I'm gonna send in S stuff, but... Uh, I don't know. I just don't know. Hopefully I can slack off through... But basically, like, Bug Buzz kinda do way more than I want it to. I just basically wanna give myself a... Better for switching over the discharge as it actually was. <sighs> Just doesn't seem right. <laughs> it does way too much. Like, here comes the bug buzz. Do I want to try to? I guess I do. I could rapid spin, just get the speed up, and then finish it off. Oh, this is the worst. I'm like super weak to bug. I'm not gonna bring in Jum Jum. I just wanna see the combinations. Because basically, I think I can go for a U turn here. Leech Life, hey! That's up there. Huh. Alright, well, U turn here. Um. Hopefully, like, this charge is better than Thunder. I can absolutely take that, but... Ah, uh, I just don't know. Withdrawals, that's fair. Here come Mashams.com! Hey, some legit mods in here. I really, really regret that they go for... You know what? Never mind. Um, oh, that's bad though. No Rocky Helmets, that's good. Right. Well, this Ref 4 is gonna come in, and I really hope I connect his Bolt Beak. 
Because if I do, then things get really scary fast. And if I miss, then you know, shit. Yeah, that's what that's hustle for you. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh shit! Okay, okay, we're in this. Hey! It looks so cool though. Let's see. Connect the bolt weak. Oh, it's absolutely outspeeding me. Oh, Jesus. I gotta get poisoned here, aren't I? Yeah, it's guaranteed too. And, oh, Jesus, alright. This is not good. This is not good at all, actually. Um. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Do I do this? Like, look at the team again. Ah. I really think my only play here is uh, bring in Scals, go for that sack play, because there is just no going about it, and get the Tailwind sacking it as he will lose his Dynamax form. Max Quake, that's better. Stomach that. The special defense the race, which means I'm really, really forced to go physical here. <sighs> this is scary. This is way scary, actually. I have like one counterplay that I think is gonna work for me, and um, since we clearly are allowing Dynamax, and I think. I think Jump Jump is here to potentially wrap up this game. Because I don't think my opponent can stop this. I have three turns of absolute devastation. And we're gonna do the best of it. I really just wanna go straight off that flare blitz, but quite frankly, I I just I know I just lose so much by doing that, so. Plus I never get to see Dom man at MB Dynamax. I was gonna Dynamax. Let's see, let's try one this one for size. Because I just. Like, sure, I lose choice, man, but I'm adamant. I have double the speed, and I am a Darman in Sanders. What else is it to know? It's gotta kill. It has to kill. Jesus, yeah, 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 mm. He was speedy too, so yeah, it had to kill. Sunlight's turning harsh indeed. Where are your switch-ins now, son? This guy, like, this is the reason, like, Dynamax got banned. Like, you counterplay a Dynamax and all of a sudden things get out of hand. It really does. So my opponent doesn't really think about this. Brings in snipes. It could be scarfed and uh, I am unflinchable. It wasn't. It wasn't. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it, it kind of is. Yeah, all right. <laughs> well, well, AJ, GG for the game. Um, what else can I say? I'm like, once I put a Dynamax, I kind of followed that route when I can. And I absolutely had upper hand when it came to Dynamax with both Hailwind and, of course, a Darmanitan. So, yeah, for that said, of course, all the guys for watching, and have a great day, everyone. Take care.